Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, guys, wherever you are on this beautiful world. And if you're watching this YouTube video, welcome to the Bitcoin Family YouTube channel. For the newcomers, my name is Didi. Today, a short TA update on Bitcoin. What is happening? Let's start with the first chart here. Bam! This one. This is the four hour chart, guys. On the four hour chart, we can see a lot of movements. Of, we can see the indicator, it's the bam bam indicator, guys. Sorry for all the noise. And we had a short flag, we took that short. We have a long flag over there, we're not taking that long yet. There is a flag. The candles are closing above the yellow stepping line, but the yellow stepping line is very flat. That's the first indication of doubt. Then we look to the bottom, we see green and a lot of blue. Second indication of doubt. Then we see that the bam bam already crossed, but it's now pointing downwards. That's a third indication of doubt. That's why we don't take that long. Now, um, when we take the long, I will add that again to our Telegram and to our uh, Discord group for the VIP members that own the bam bam indicators. If you want to become a VIP member, bam, you go to the bitcoinfamily.com and you check this uh, menu with products indicated packages and there you can check uh, what to do to become bronze silver or gold vip the website will be soon updated so uh, be aware there can be some changes on the website now let's zoom out to the next chart this one the weekly chart very important chart for me because i love to look at the weekly and i found something on the weekly that i want to share with you just to see if you see the same um if you look at the weekly chart you can see, for example, that those green areas on the bottom is the pearl multiple. Every time that happens around the bottom, these green areas, COVID crash, green areas again. So we are near the bottom on the weekly chart, which means we could be forming a double bottom, which means we could go again to try and break that red line. That's at 23K levels. It also could happen that we break that purple line. That would be the first time in the history of Bitcoin. And if we break that purple line, uh, we would, could go all the way to an 82% drop from the all-time high to 12K. But that would be the first time in the history of Bitcoin that these green areas over there were not indication that we were already near the bottom and that we break that purple line. We touched the purple line once over there during the COVID dip. But we never broke it so for me that purple line at the moment is a massive area of support and the purple line is around 17,500. now that is really beautiful to see on the weekly now we are going to zoom a little bit more out onto the monthly and guys if you want to trade all of this then make sure you sign up to bam this exchange just scan the QR code, it will take you to Bybit. Bybit is my favorite exchange for many reasons, also that they sponsored uh, Max Verstappen, but just an awesome exchange that have been up and running 24-7 for many years, and I can always trade over there. You will get a bonus up to $4,100, uh, depending on how much you deposit, and you can get a 30% fee discount on uh, leverage trades, but on spot trading at the moment, it is zero fee zero fee on spot rates on bybit so be aware sign up if you want to use an awesome exchange over there use that one bam bybit now we are now on the monthly again they are building a house next door that's why it is a little bit noisy on the monthly we can see from top till top it took 49 bars um, and then again from that top to this top took 46 bars so that's 1400 days that's 1419 days so let's say it's an average of 1450 days so every time again we see that same cycle happening here if you would do the top to the next stop over there let's say 1400 days that would be august 25 if we would make a top uh, according the bottom then we would say the bottom is reached here we take 35 bars that's 1065 days to the next stop in the second run you take the bottom over there 34 bars 1035 days to the next stop if we take the bottom here let's say the bottom is in it would take 34 bars 1035 days all the way to the april of 25 to see the next top if we would function according the um, cycles but look this one the top number of months and the bottom number of months they always ended at the same time if we were 34 bars and 50 bars they ended in the same month 
46 bars and 34 bars they ended in the same month so now there is a difference does that mean of a couple of uh, weeks that we still need the bottom and that we can shift this one to the same level so that the bottom will be in this week or next week very interesting in the monthly but again i think we are near the bottom also every time when the orange line crosses that blue line there is an indication of the bottom just check the months check stop the video and watch the um, you know the numbers and everything if you want to see more information now let's go to this one this is the total market cap guys let's see is the total market cap also um, you know breaking that previous all-time high this was the total market cap previous all-time high 760 billion did we break that level yet no we touched it over there and that level was touched you know during that huge dip there's a total market cap of crypto so this looks very healthy we touched the one line we bounced to the 1.6 line we are coming down maybe again touch that one line and then maybe take it over take it up from there but if you um, look at it very simple maybe it's more simple if we would draw a line from here to there look up a straight line something like that look you can see that that previous top is holding as support at the moment really positive in my opinion now let's quickly jump into some more interesting charts over here this is the first one this is showing you how the bottoms were created in the last bull cycles 2014 the bottom looked like that 2018 the bottom looked like that and 2022 the bottom is now looking like this so are we going to break that top line over here that will be confirmation i think that the bottom is in because every time when we did that then the bottom was in so could we go a little bit more downwards and then up yes we are waiting for the confirmation of that line we need to uh, break that line in my opinion with the pinkish uh, bitcoin price breaking the short term uh, cost basis that would mean in my opinion at the bottom could be in if we compare it to the previous bottoms if you look at the cross that is going to be happening then that cross could be happening over there the 22nd of september so that's like in two days we could see that cross over there why is this cross very important the short-term holler cross long-term holler cross i will show you that in this next chart okay here we go bam on this chart we can see that every time when that cross happened we had a bottom check cross happened the bottom was in and beautiful here we are um, crossing that bluish line is crossing that dark one level and coming up later again when we go bullish here look the cross came the bottom was in the bluish line is crossing that black line and later we come up again now look what is going to happen in those two days the cross will be in yes probably the bottom will be in yes that blue line is again going to cross that black line so it's a perfect copy of what we saw in the last cycle so that could mean that yes we are really near or we already saw that bottom at the moment so for me that is the important thing for you to understand that i believe that the bottom could be already in and if not it is very close to the bottom so would i now stress about buying bitcoin do i think that i can get it a little bit cheaper no i buy bitcoin at the moment because i believe that we are seeing this bottom or near the bottom or we already had the bottom very close to each other and that's the moment you should be buying and accumulating as much as possible bitcoin because the run will come there will be another run and the run will be maybe time seven so i would always add to my portfolio at the moment now that's a very short update i hope you really enjoyed the charts if you did enjoy the charts give it a thumbs up share with your friends and family subscribe to the channel hit the notification bell and leave a comment what do you think about all of this if you want to sign up to an exchange then please use this uh, code or click one of the links down below the video that's also very simple of course if there is anything else that you want me to talk about in next one of the next videos then let me know down below in the comments as well now i want to thank you for watching this one and hope to see you uh, yeah tomorrow wednesday again bam